All right, hi guys, I'm Kevin Evangelista. Welcome to my channel. And today we've got an unboxing of something different. I know I'm a tech channel, but I'm like unboxing some lifestyle stuff right now. And it's from Corin. Uh, if you guys are not familiar, Corin makes cleaning products. And uh, recently they reached out to me and said, yo, we liked your content and we think you're a good fit for our new like line of products. So yeah, I accepted. I've been actually I've been using using Corin since like two years ago. Uh, they make like ionized water cleaning products. But before we continue with the video, let's keep the lights on here in the studio. This video is brought to you by Sneak Attack Design Lab. They're a clothing company that specializes in technical fashion, more commonly known as techwear. And you can see me in their clothes in most of my videos. I've been supporting their brand ever since I met them back in 2019, and now they're returning the favor. Head on over to this link, you can find it in the description as well, to get 10% off your order from their site. Check their clothes out, you're bound to see something badass over there that'll look great on you. Thank you very much to Sneak Attack for this exclusive promo for my viewers. Now, back to the video. I know that sounds weird, but behind the scenes, I am kind of like a clean freak. Uh, not a neat freak. A neat freak is kind of like, oh, the, the desk has to be like super tidy, like super like minimalist. And I don't really like that. I am a fan of Tom Sachs and Casey Neistat and Van Neistat. And I had, have arranged my desk. I set up my desk as much. Everything has to be like uh, within arm's reach and everything has to be like super ergonomic and my desk is mainly that so if you think my desk is kind of like a mess it's not it it just means everything is at arm's length i can if i need something i can just reach it like when i need like uh scissors scissors are just here and they're neatly like organized and everything but i am a clean freak meaning i want my devices and i want everything to be super clean as possible i i don't like the feeling of dirty hands touching dirty products or touching dirty equipment so yeah when kareen reached out i was super game and right, let's go let's see your new products very simple box very simple cardboard box <laughs> it just says here open happiness of cleaning here what a very japanese thing it also says here like for each bottle inside this box is your cleaner sanitizer degreaser deodorizer and disinfectant sure i am super happy with that anyway let's open it up it says here, start your modern home care and cleaning routine. Make Corinne a habit. There's also a note here. Hi, Kevin. We hope that you'll get to enjoy cleaning with these new Corinne products. Thank you so much for your continued support and happy cleaning. Thank you for receiving our package. We're thrilled to have you as one of the first to unbox our improved packaging and try out our new products. In this package, you'll find the OG Super Ionized Corinne Water, a versatile, chemical-free and odor-free multipurpose cleaner. Additionally, we're excited to introduce our latest product, the Scented Corinne Multipurpose Cleaner. What makes this new Corinne different is that it now has a delightful fragrance. Wow, it's gonna smell really good. While still maintaining its commitment to being free of harsh chemicals. That that thing is the reason why we use Corinne. Uh, no harsh chemicals. Your opinion matters to us. That's why we can't wait to hear your thoughts and feedback about it. We are forever grateful for your love and support. Well, thank you very much, Corinne, for like working with me. Just a little background. That's why we chose Corinne because uh, this is super ionized water this is not alcohol my wife and i chose to start using Corinne because uh that was a time when our baby was uh born uh, my daughter uh, our daughter so uh we can't use alcohol on every surface because alcohol is a bit too harsh especially when it's being handled or it's going to be touched by a baby so we started using uh super ionized water and Corinne has a lot of uh like ionized water like variants uh some of them some of them are for tech some of them for like multi-purpose some of them are for like food or some of them for like like utensils and yeah uh we've been very happy with the performance of like cleaning so far. but now they have a scented version i guess so it's pretty good Generally, I like using super ionized water when cleaning tech because alcohol has its uh, place in cleaning tech because alcohol like dissolves or uh, 
what they call this, vaporizes really fast. And that's good for stuff that really can't be washed down with water, like motherboards or PC, uh, PCBs, uh, because you can use the alcohol to clean it, then it'll vaporize, then there's no danger of shorting anything out. But you can't really use alcohol to clean out stuff that has coating on it or is supposed to be handled th that would make things like degrade super easily one example is monitor screens so don't use alcohol on monitor screens or on phones because alcohol will break down the oleophobic coating on phones and it will break some uh, matte coatings on monitors so you should be using uh, if not distilled water super ionized water you should be using those two because super ionized water and distilled water doesn't have particulates in it if you use mineral water there are some particulates and some of them might scratch up your monitor or leave residues that can speed up the growth of bacteria so yeah if you're cleaning tech and you're supposed to be touching that tech or it's supposed to be like coming into contact with your bodily oils it's better to clean it with either super 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 like low concentration alcohol and some water or just water distilled water or super ionized water yeah first up inside the box we have the korean multi-purpose cleaner super ionized water this is a one liter refill bottle okay pretty good it's made with 99.98 percent water ionized and 0.02 percent food grade potassium carbonate right no harsh chemicals here second thing inside the box is like a little like spray uh, nozzle all right uh next up we have the pocket sanitizer i love this i actually have one Ooh. i actually have one right here on my desk this is the one i've been using it's a korean pocket as you can see there is like a difference in the packaging it says here this one is the one actually it's right actually it's like all used up now this is a korean pocket i use this to clean all my stuff and this is the korean pocket sanitizer so yeah i mean it's the same thing just a little bit up updated so yeah this is probably going to go on my desk take out yeah then we have another multi-purpose cleaner a bottle a 500 ml bottle so this is one this is where you should like put the nozzle in because this is probably like for the big things uh, i have another of these like down there uh, in my like tray for cleaning stuff uh, and i use it to clean monitors and stuff and lastly i think this is like the pièce de résistance uh, this is wrapped in like a bow and some more of that like cardboard funny funny packaging but yeah let's let's undo the bow take it out of the packaging all right oh this one probably is the scented one okay so these are two korean pocket sanitizers and they are scented as you can see uh this green one uh ocha oka i don't know how to read this it's o-c-h-a oka ocha and this one is yuzu i don't know what those are uh, this one has leaves on it, a leaf design. Sure, and this one has like orange. Is Yuzu orange? So this is what I want to check out first. <laughs> Yuzu is probably orange because it says they're orange. I don't know what Oka is, Ocha. I am not Japanese. I cannot read Japanese. I only like look Japanese, but I am not Japanese. I am Filipino. Oh, it smells really good. It's like... like it's like mint it smells like mint leaves okay so ocha ocha green tea inspired scent gives a bright fresh pleasant and soothing fragrance it's made with 99.98 percent water ionized and 0.02 percent food grade potassium carbonate with fragrance oil all right it smells really good i like it a bit more it's kind of like mint it's like a minty but without like the super menthol like smell Let's check out yuzu my wife is gonna love this yuzu citrus inspired scent provides a bright refreshing and citrusy smell creating a clean sparkling and invigorating fragrance invigorating i like that word 
Oh, I like this one better. It smells like lemongrass. <laughs> I wish I could like portray the scent better. Hints of cinnamon or something like that. <laughs> but no, uh, I am not like a scent expert. I wear the same fragrance every day. <laughs> the green one smells like mint and uh, the yellow one smells like lemongrass and a bit of like orange. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but yeah. So yeah, just to like uh, try this out, we are going to be uh, cleaning two of my most used pieces of tech right now. So incidentally, I also chose like two white pieces of tech so first off we have my jbl uh earbuds these are uh, first off when i show this to you guys just remember that i purposefully made it dirty did not clean it for like two weeks just to shoot this video and the other one is the rog ally this is not this is technically not my rog ally this is like a review unit but as you can see i've been using it enough that the back here is kind of like gross and orange now and there are some like scuff marks because they've been touching my clothes but yeah we're gonna be cleaning it also the screen is kind of like kind of like gross like that <laughs> so we're gonna be cleaning it and i'm gonna be demonstrating how to how i clean my stuff with green okay for this cleaning segment i am going to be getting like a microfiber cloth and i'm going to be using the pocket sanitizer uh we will not be using the the yuzu and the Ocha. How I clean my devices with the Korean pocket sanitizer. Like I said, uh, please do not use alcohol when cleaning screens or when cleaning stuff that actually like uh, gets in touch with your body because alcohol is a bit too harsh. If there's like residue of alcohol left, uh, especially in the buds, when you put it in your ears, it might irritate your ears. So yeah, just use ionized water and make sure to wipe down everything or clean up everything as thoroughly as you can. So yeah, we're gonna be cleaning the screen and the back of the ROG Ally, the white ROG Ally. So if you're using ionized water to clean your stuff, please do not spray it directly onto your device. If you spray it onto your device, it might get into the little cracks, especially here in the speaker holes of the ROG Ally or in the gap between the screen and the body. So you don't want that because it might like damage something on the ROG Ally. So you just spray it on to your microfiber cloth and you start like working it in. Then what I would do is when I'm done when I'm done wiping it down with the wet side, I just like turn around and go for the other corner on the dry side and just wipe down everything. So it just removes all of that like water, like stain and water. Uh, uh, what do you call that? Like the dust that's been uh, agitated by the water. So yeah, now that's a clean ROG Ally screen. Okay. Then we move on to the back. So as you can see, the back of the ROG Ally is pretty dirty because I've been using it on most days. So what we're going to do is set it down, find our wet spot again, then I'll probably use like four sprays on this. Again, I am not spraying directly onto the device and I am using that side to wipe down the device. It's pretty effective. Look at that. This side is a bit more white than this one. All right, let's do that for another side as well. Another two sprays. Yeah, all clean now. If I wanted to do this a little bit more thoroughly, I will probably also clean the bumpers and uh, the buttons. But you know, this is just like a demo of Corinne. Uh I will be going back to regularly cleaning this. <laughs> <laughs> after this because i kind of like purposefully made it dirty for like a week just so i can shoot this video <laughs> generally my devices are like super clean all of the time anyway this is the disgusting one i actually stopped using this for <laughs> after i made it like super dirty the first time but these are my jbl i forgot what model these are but yeah these were a gift from jbl i reviewed this on the brent pro tv channel and they've been my daily buds ever since and i've made them like super dirty <laughs> 
I made them super dirty for the express reason to shoot this video. Look at that. That's the dirt of my ear. When cleaning devices like these, uh, like I said, please don't use alcohol. Or if you have to use alcohol, please use a really, 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 really light concentration of alcohol. Like those 10% alcohols or 15% alcohols. Don't use the 90% or the 80% like rubbing alcohol types. Because that will ruin the finish of the product and... The higher the concentration of alcohol, the much less surface tension that it has. So it has much more penetration. So it might get into the little cracks of the device and just ruin your device from the inside. Remember, alcohol is really fast to uh, dissipate but it will only dissipate if there is enough like space. If the gasket escape, it will stay in liquid form. To clean this, we will be using brain pocket or actually we're gonna be using one of the scented ones just to make it look like a bit more interesting we're gonna be using one of the scented ones and I got here like a little like q-tip so just use this q-tip to clean out this part oh my god that is super disgusting super dirty so yeah this is a new q-tip let's get this other area cleaned out just to make sure I got all the oils off so the buds themselves are super dirty as we can see here uh, clean those up clean that part just make sure that you're getting all of these like little nooks and crannies of the the product of the item that you're cleaning then once i'm done back to the uh microfiber cloth i'm just gonna give everything a good wipe down just to make sure that there's no like remaining water on there i am using the dry side there we go all clean now ready for my next adventure when i'm out commuting super clean super clean <laughs> exciting video i know but yeah those are the new products from kareen uh they have the usual like kareen super ionized water over here and they have new scented like versions here uh which has ocha and yuzu oka ocha i, I please correct me in the comments so yeah, if you have any questions about this, of course I'm not going to be reviewing them, there's nothing to review about them, but yeah, they smell really good. I like the Ocha one. The Yuzu one is also good. It smells very lemongrassy. Uh, I think if I keep smelling lemongrass like throughout the day, I'm going to be like super hungry <laughs> because I like, this, I like the taste of lemongrass. But anyway, if you have any questions about them, please leave them down in the comment. Uh, if you want to buy one of these, I will be putting a link in the description. So yeah, thank you very much, Kareen, for uh, working with me on this video. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Please keep all of your tech clean. See you guys in the next one. Bye.